Hello and welcome everyone. I'm so glad you are here. Uh, we are going to explore some exciting and practical aspects of transformer partition testing using the CMC 500, the latest industry benchmark of partition testing. So if you are ready to dive into the details and learn something new, all right, let's move on to the exciting part two of today's video, the practical demo. Now uh, that we have covered the theory, it's time to uh, roll up our sleeves and get our hands on session because we are diving into the practical side of the testing. So it's time to put, to put it into action and test a three winding transformer protection testing uh, using the uh, CMC 500, the new benchmark in the protection uh, testing. For those of you uh, who don't know me yet, I am Hamad Adia, a training and application engineer at Omicron Maya Bahrain office. I have been in the electrical engineering field for over 12 years of experience, specializing in testing and commissioning. And my goal today is to make this demo clear, practical, and most importantly, useful for all of you. So let's jump right in. Now, uh, I know many of you are familiar with the complexity of transformer testing, but with the CMC 500 and Test Universe software, the process becomes much smoother, more efficient, and uh, more useful. Uh, whether you are a professional engineer or just getting started, this setup is designed to help you uh, master the testing easily. And here is uh, what we are going to do. First, we will walk through the basic setup and the basic steps uh, to test the protection starting from uh, the scratch. And this will give you a solid foundation. Then we will take it a step further and create a fully automated and a fully customized test the plan using the Omicron Ohm's law to really streamline the process. So let us start with opening the Micom S1 Agile for the uh, GE Micom B643 uh, relay to test the three winding uh, transformer protection uh, testing. And once you uh, create your uh, own file and own project and configuring uh, all the parameter settings along with the PSL. Now uh, we can take a look about the uh, setting. As you can see here, this is the CT and the VT ratio for the three winding. T1 is for high voltage, which have a CT ratio uh, 400 over one. T2 is for uh, the tertiary side, which have a CT ratio 2400 over one. T3 is for the LV side, which is 600 over one. TN1 for the neutral of the high voltage side, which have 400. Uh, ratio over one tn2 is the lv neutral uh, side 600 over one and tn3 last but not least is for the tertiary side uh, neutral which have 240,000 over one and as you can uh, go through a lot of uh, details here in the testing and we can go directly to uh, group one and explore the uh, system configuration as you can see so we have a three winding trans uh, transformer high voltage uh, low voltage and tertiary uh, voltage and here is the uh, ct terminal for each winding for high voltage low voltage and uh, tertiary voltage and here is a reference bar which is 160 megavolt ampere and the reference vector group and the uh, vector uh, the high voltage connection start grounded with the high voltage nominal uh, 271 kV and also for the LV side start grounded 115.5 and TV also is delta with a vector group 5 and uh, ungrounded with a TV nominal uh, high volt, uh, TV nominal voltage 10.5 kV and TV rating is 42 megavolt uh, MB. Then we will uh, talk about the differential uh, protection uh, parameter. As you can see here, the transformer differential is enabled and the IS1 is 0.25. K1 is 30 percentage or 0.3, IS2 is 4 per unit, K2 is 20 percentage, and uh, we have the high set, which is uh, 10 uh, per uh, unit. And then uh, we have also a second harmonic uh, differential block, which is 20 uh, percentage, and also the fifth harmonic block, which is 45 uh, percentage. So uh, once we, uh, we you are ready, you can export the parameter setting from here. You can right click and export to uh, X-ray you, as you can see, and then you can select uh, which, which export this parameter setting into N, uh, and then you can import it inside the uh, OCC uh, file, as you uh, can uh, see. Then uh, I have exported already, so just I give you a short introduction about how to use the software. 